Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to find all the solutions of the floor value of x plus the floor value of x plus half is equal to 1022. I will be presenting the solution in two methods. The first method, we are going to use the natural definition of the floor value of x. The second method, we will be solving the problem about a minute. For the first method, Suppose that the floor value of x is equal k. By the definitions of the floor value of x, we have x is between k and k plus 1. Adding by half, we have x plus half is between k plus half and k plus 3 over 2. We can decompose this interval into two intervals such that x plus half is between k plus half and k plus 1 or x plus half is between k plus 1 and k plus 3 over 2. For the first interval, we have that the floor value of x plus half is equal k. And for the second interval, we have that the floor value of x plus half is equal k plus 1. If we substitute the floor value of x and these two values of the floor value of x plus half into the equation on the problem, we have 2k is equal to 1022 or 2k plus 1 is equal to 1022. We have k is equal 1011 or k is equal 1010.5. Because k is an integer, then k is equal 1011. Because we already have that the floor value of x is equal k, and the floor value of x plus half is equal k, so we have the floor value of x is equal the floor value of x plus half equal to 1011. By the definition of the floor value, we have that x is between 1011 and 1012 and x is between 1010.5 and 1011.5. Because x satisfies these two inequality, then x is between 1011 and 1011.5. And there we get the solution from the first method. For the second method, we are going to use Hermit's identity. Hermit's identity says that the floor value of x plus the floor value of x plus 1 over n plus until the floor value of x plus n minus 1 over n is equal the floor value of nx. In case n is equal to, we have the floor value of x plus the floor value of x plus 1 over 2 is equal the floor value of 2x. Substitute this result into the equation on the problem. We have the floor value of 2x is equal to 1022. By the definitions of the floor value, we have 2x is between 2022 and 2023. Divided by 2, we have x is between 1011 and 1011.5. And there we get the solutions from the second method. So, we are done.